بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم اهلا بكم في حلقه جديده وفيديو جديد من قناتنا انجليش فور عربس النهارده ان شاء الله هناخد الوحده الثامنه الجزء الاولاني من الوحده الثامنه هتضمن الفيديو النهارده اول حاجه معاني الكلمات باللغه الانجليزيه والترجمه موجوده بالعربي وقلنا ان اهم حاجه نحفظ الكلمه ومعناها بالانجليش مش بالعربي محدش يحفظ العربي خالص بعد كده بعد لما نحفظ الكلمات بالانجليش نحاول نحط الكلمه في جمله عشان نستخدم الكلمة نمبر 2 هيكون الجزء الثاني عبارة عن شرح للوحدة تمنة النص الأولاني الاكسرسايزز والأجواء بتاعتها والجزء الثالث هيكون جرامر في عندنا باوربوينت عن there is و there are there is يوجد و there are يوجد للجمع وهيكون عليهم درس الباوربوينت بريزنتيشن الجزء الأخير Unit 8 What's your neighborhood like? What's your neighborhood like? Describe your neighborhood. 1. Neighborhood Places around your home. Barber shop A place where you get a haircut. Get a T soft D. A place where you get a haircut. Laundromat A place where you wash and dry clothes. Clothes T H E S clothes the sound clothes library a place where you borrow box stationery store stationery store a place where you buy cards and paper travel agency travel agency a place where you make reservations for a trip a place where you make reservations for a trip Grocery store, a place where you buy food, a place where you buy food. Theater, theater, T, soft D, and R, R, theater. A place where you see a movie or play, a place where you see a movie. Clothing, clothing store, clothing store, a place where you find new fashions. Clothing store, place where you find new fashions. Drug store, drug store, pharmacy, PH as fast sound, pharmacy. A place where you buy medicine, a place where you buy medicine. Internet cafe, internet cafe, internet, internet. خلينا نقول internet ممكن نقول كمان internet. بالامريكان الامريكان انترنت كافي انترنت كافي تي سايلنت ا بليس وير يو سيند ايميلز اند سيرفز انترنت ا بليس وير يو سيند ايميلز اند سيرفز انترنت ميوزك ستور ا بليس وير يو باي سي ديز اند دي في ديز باست اوفيس ا بليس وير يو جيت ستامبس اند ميل ليترز باست اوفيس باست اوفيس ا بليس وير يو جيت ستامبس and mail letters mail to post to post a letter to exercise to neighbor neighbor American British neighbor with you in e i g h b o u r British you are American o r excuse me pardon me three gas station car service station gas station car service station place where you fill your car with petrol a payphone a payphone a phone booth it's a phone that needs coins a phone that needs coins Across from to opposite British opposite across from to opposite near close to close to there is plus a singular noun a singular noun one there are a plural noun a plural noun 
two, three, four. There are a plural noun. Plural noun two, three, four. Five karaoke bar. I'm not sure. Maybe. Aquarium. Aquarium. Unit eight. Interchange one. Unit eight. Third edition. What's your neighborhood like? Word power. Places. In this unit, we will talk about the neighborhood. Neighborhood. Area. Areas around your house, around your home. The area you are living in it. Neighborhood district. Match the words and the definitions, then practice asking the questions with a partner. What's a? What's a barber shop? It's a place where you. Here you match. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven with A, B, C, D, E, F, G. Match. The place, this is barber shop, laundromat, laundromat, laundry, library, stationery store, travel agency, grocery store, theater, theater, T soft D. You match the word with the meaning. One minute, try to answer. One, a barber shop. What's a barber shop? It's a place where you. It's a place where you get a haircut. Get a, t soft d. Get a haircut. A barber shop, a place where you get a haircut. Two. What's a laundromat? It's a place where you wash and dry clothes. Clothes. Not clothes, clothes. Not a sah, clothes. Three. Library. Library. G. It's a place where you borrow box. Four. Stationery store. Stationery store. It's a place where you buy cards and paper. Five. What's travel agency? It's a place where you make reservations for a trip. Reservations for a trip. Six. What's a grocery store? It's a place where you buy food. Eight. What's a theater? A theater. It's a place where you see a movie or play. Again, the answers, one, D, two, A, three, G, four, C, five, F, six, B, seven, E. Write definitions for these places. Clothing store, clothing, clothing store, Drug store, pharmacy. Clothing store is a place where you find new fashions. Drug store, pharmacy is a place where you buy medicine. Internet cafe is a place where you serve the internet. Post office is a place where you Send letters, mail letters. Exercise number two. Conversation. I'm your new neighbor. Look at the picture, what do you see? Young man, an old lady, the young man, He's wearing jeans, 
He has long hair, long blonde hair. The lady, she's old lady. She has gray hair, gray hair. The man, the, man, the young man asking for something, or for a place. The, the old lady, the old lady describing the place for him. Let's start to listen. Unit 8. What's your neighborhood like? Page 50. Exercise 2. Conversation. I'm your new neighbor. Listen and practice. Excuse me, I'm your new neighbor, Jack. I just moved in. Oh, yes? I'm looking for a grocery store. Are there any around here? Yes, there are some on Pine Street. Oh, good. And is there a laundromat near here? Well, I think there's one across from the shopping center. Thank you. By the way, there's a barber shop in the shopping center, too. A barber shop? Who's Jack? Jack is a new neighbor. He just moved in. He moved, he changed. He moved to a new house. He moved to a new place. What's Jack looking for? Jack is looking for a grocery store. A grocery store, a supermarket. A small supermarket. Are there any grocery stores around here? Yes, there are. There are some on Pine Street. There are some grocery stores on Pine Street. Is there a laundromat near here? What's a laundromat? A laundromat, a place to wash and dry clothes. Yes, there is. There is one across from the shopping center. Why did she tell Jack? that there is a barber shop there is a barber shop in the shopping center because Jack has long hair this is why she told him there is a barber shop in the shopping center exercise number three There is, there are, one, any, and some. Page 51. Exercise 3. Grammar focus. There is, there are, one, any, some. Is there a laundromat near here? Yes, there is. There's one across from the shopping center. No, there isn't. But there's one next to the library. Are there any grocery stores around here? Yes, there are. There are some nice stores on Pine Street. No, there aren't. But there are some on 3rd Avenue. No, there aren't any around here. Prepositions. On. Next to. Near, close to, across from, opposite, in front of, in back of, behind, between, on the corner of. The red, the raw. Is there a laundromat near here? Yes, the red. No, the red isn't. So, there is plus singular, singular noun, one. Example, there's a television in the room. Example, there's a television in the room. The written plus singular noun. There isn't a radio in my room. Question, 
Is there? Is there a television in your room? Is there a laundromat near here? Yes, there is. There is one across from the shopping center. Across from opposite to. Is there a laundromat near here? No, there isn't. But there is one next to the library. Library, a place where you can borrow books. A place to borrow books. Are there any grocery stores around here? Stores with S plural. Yes, there are. Yes, there are. There are some nice stores on Pine Street. There are plural noun plus plural noun, plural noun, two, three, four. No, there aren't, but there are some on Third Avenue. No, there aren't any around here. Prepositions, on, on, next to, next to, beside, near, close to, across from, opposite, British opposite, in front of, in front of, of, in front of, opposite, in back of, behind, in front of, opposite, like that, in back of, behind, between, on the corner of, on the corner of. Now, let's, let's explain there is and there are There is, there are. There is, and there are. There is a television in my living room. There is, there is a television. There is a radio in my home. There is a sofa in the living room. Again, there is, there is television in my living room. There is a radio in my home. There is a sofa in my living room. There is, plus television, a radio, a sofa. This is sofa. So there is, plus singular noun. Singular, one. There is, plus one. There is television, there is a radio, there is sofa. There is plus singular means one. This is sofa, sofa. There are, there are, there are three chairs in the room. There are some eggs. There are two students in the class. There are, there are some eggs. There are three chairs. There are two students. There are plus plural. Plural, two, three, four, five, six. Plural noun, two, three, four, five. There is, there are. Negative, there is. Negative, there isn't. Question, is there? There are, negative, there aren't. Question, are there? Negative, T, soft D. Unit 8, there is. There is a supermarket. There isn't a post office in the street. There is, there isn't, plus a singular noun. A singular noun? One, there is a supermarket, there isn't a post office.
question is there is there is there a supermarket near here is there a supermarket near here yes there is there is one next to the bank yes there is there is one next to the bank are is there a restaurant around here is there a restaurant around here no there isn't no there isn't in around here is there is there a supermarket near here yes there is there is one next to the bank is there a restaurant around here no there isn't no there isn't any around here Is there plus a singular noun? Singular noun one near here. Answer yes, there is. No, there isn't. No, there isn't in around here. Is there singular noun one near here? Answer yes, there is. No, there isn't. No, there isn't in around here. There are, there are, there are, there are three supermarkets in the street. There aren't any past offices in the street. There are, or there aren't, plus a plural noun, plural noun, two, three, four. Again, there are, there aren't, there are three supermarkets in the street. There aren't any past offices in the street. There are, there aren't, plus a plural noun, plural noun, plural noun, two, three, four. Question. Are there, are there in supermarkets near here? Yes, there are. There are on, there are some on the Tahrir street. Are there any restaurants around here? No, there aren't. No, there aren't any around here. Are there, question, are there in supermarkets near here? Yes, there are. There are some on the Tahrir street. Are there any restaurants around here? No, there aren't. No, there aren't any around here. Are there? Are there any? Plus a plural noun. Near here. Plural noun two, three, four. Are there any? Plus a plural noun. Plural noun two, three, four. Near here. Are there any? Plural noun near here? Yes, there are. No, there aren't. No, there aren't any around here. Are there any plural noun near here? Yes, there are. No, there aren't. No, there aren't any around here. A. Write questions about these places. Bank, a department store, gas stations, grocery stores, a jam, hotels, a laundromat, a payphone, a post office, restaurants, restaurants, and restaurants. You ask a question about this map. 
and then you try to describe the place. A bank. Is there a bank near here? Is there a bank around here? Where is the bank? First National Bank. You're here? Someone asks you, is there a bank near here? Yes, there is. There is one on Pine Street. The first National Bank, bank is on Pine Street. The first National Bank is on the corner of First Avenue and Pine Street. There is one next to Prince's Grocery Store. Next to Prince's Grocery Store. Another question. Is there a department store near here? Department store. Yes, there is. Yes, there is. There is Oday's department store on Main Street. There is one on Main Street. There is one next to the gym, next to Joy's gym. Another question. Are there any gas stations around here? Gas station. Yes, there are. There are some on First Avenue. And sir, on First Avenue, we have here gas stations. Is there a gym around here? Gym. Yes, there is. There is one on Main Street next to the post office. There is one on Main Street between the post office and O'Day's department store. There is Joey's Jam on Main Street. Is there a laundromat near here? Laundromat. Laundromat. A place to wash and dry clothes. A laundromat. Laundromat laundry. Yes, there is. There is one on First Avenue. This is First Avenue. There is one on First Avenue behind the post office. Is there a payphone around here? A payphone? Phone, a phone that needs coins. Yes, there is. There is one on Main Street. This is a payphone, it's very small. There is one between First Avenue and Second Avenue. There is one in front of the post office. There is one opposite to the post office. There is one opposite to the post office. There is one on Main Street. Is there a post office? Yes, there is. There is one on Main Street. There is one on the corner of Main Street and First Avenue. This is corner. Corner between two streets. On the corner. On the corner of First Avenue and Main Street. Corner. The post office is on the corner of Main Street and First Avenue. Are there any restaurants around here? Yes, there are. There is Rose's Restaurant. Rose's Restaurant next to Frank's Cafe. Rose's Restaurant on Maple Avenue. Rose's Restaurant on the corner of Pine Street and Maple Avenue. Exercise number 4. Exercise 4. Pronunciation. Reduction of there is, there are. Reduction. Shortage. Page 52. Exercise 4. Pronunciation. Reduction of there is, 
There are. Part A. Listen and practice. Notice how there is and there are are reduced in conversation, except for short answers. Is there a laundromat near here? Yes, there is. There's one across from the shopping center. Are there any grocery stores around here? Yes, there are. There are some on Pine Street. Listen again. Page 52. Exercise 4. Pronunciation. Yes, there is. There's one across from the shopping center. Short answers. Is there a laundromat near here? Yes, there is. There's one across from the shopping center. Are there any grocery stores around here? Yes, there are. There are some on Pine Street. Short answers. Is there a laundromat near here? Yes, there is. There's one across from the shopping center. Are there any grocery stores around here? Yes, there are. There are some on Pine Street. For pronunciation, reduction of there is and there are. Reduction shortage. There is and there are are reduced. Except for short answers. Is there a laundromat near here? Yes, there is. So when I say yes, there is, the answer here is not reduced. Yes, there is. There is one across from the shopping center. There is one. Don't say there is one. No, there is. There is one. There is one across from the shopping center. Are there any grocery stores around here? Yes, there are. Short answer. Yes, there are. There are some on Pine Street. Make link. There are. There are some, in, there are some on Pine Street. There is. There is. There is one across from the shopping center. Link. There is. There are. There are some on Pine Street. Exercise number five. Look at the picture. What do you see? A young lady. She's in a bookstore or she's in a library. She's in a library, maybe. Yeah. What's she doing? She's reading. She's reading a book. Speaking. My neighborhood. The actor is asking and answering questions about places like this in your neighborhood. A bookstore, coffee shops, dance clubs, drug stores, a gym, an internet cafe, a karaoke bar, a library, movie theaters, music store, a park, restaurants. Use this expression, useful expressions. Sorry, I don't know. I don't know, I don't know the place. I'm not sure, but I think. I'm not sure, maybe. Maybe. Of course, there is one. Example. A, B, C, and D. Conversation between four persons. You can make it between two persons, A and B. Is there a good bookstore in your neighborhood? Bookstore? Bookshop. Yes, there is. There's an excellent one across from the park. Are there any coffee shops? Coffee shops. Sorry, I don't know. I don't know the place. Are there any cool dance clubs? Cool? Wonderful. Wonderful dance clubs? I'm not sure, but I think there is one on El Haram Street. Drug stores. Drug stores, pharmacies. Are there any drug stores around here? Yes, there are. There are some drug stores on El Tahrir Street. In front of the Russian center. Is there a gym around here? 
Yes, there is. There is one next to the library. Is there an internet cafe around here? Yes, there is. There is one. There is one next to the gym. Is there a karaoke bar around here? A karaoke bar? A place? Anyone can go and sing. You have there is DJ and anyone can go and sing. Is there a karaoke bar around here? Yes, there is. There is one next to the gym. Is there a library around here? Sorry, I don't know. A library, a place to borrow box. Are there any movie theaters around here? Yes, there are. There is one in Tahrir Street, a Tahrir movie theater. Is there a park around here? Yes, there is. There is the Azhar Park. Are there any restaurants around here? Of course. There is one at Tahrir Street. Exercise number six. This is the last exercise in the first part of unit seven is listening. Listen carefully. Exercise six. Listening. What are you looking for? Part A. Listen to some hotel guests ask about places to visit in the neighborhood. Complete the chart. Good morning. Can I help you? Yes. We need some directions. Sure. What are you looking for? Well, first of all, we're looking for the Hard Rock Cafe. How far is it from here? Oh, it's just a few minutes from here. Right across from the National Bank. The National Bank on Park Avenue? Yes, that's the one. Is the Hard Rock Cafe a nice place? Well, I think so. The food is good, and there are some interesting things to look at in the restaurant. Like one of Elvis's cars. Great. Listen again. Complete the chart. Good morning. Can I help you? Yes. We need some directions. Sure. What are you looking for? Well, first of all, we're looking for the Hard Rock Cafe. How far is it from here? Oh, it's just a few minutes from here. Right across from the National Bank. The National Bank on Park Avenue? Yes, that's the one. Is the Hard Rock Cafe a nice place? Well, I think so. The food is good, and there are some interesting things to look at in the restaurant, like one of Elvis's cars. Great. And where is the Science Museum? Well, that's near City Hall. Near City Hall, okay. I know where that is. And what's the museum like? Actually, it's not very good. It's small, and there isn't a lot to see there. It's really for young kids. Oh, then maybe we won't go there. Hmm. And where is the science museum? Well, that's near City Hall. Near City Hall. Okay. I know where that is. And what's the museum like? Actually, it's not very good. It's small, and there isn't a lot to see there. It's really for young kids. Oh. Then maybe we won't go there. Hmm. Number three. Listen. Question. Is there an aquarium in the city? Yes, there's a very good one. It's only about six blocks from here. It's in the park next to the train station. Oh, next to the train station. Yes, definitely visit the aquarium. Great. Thanks a lot. You're welcome. Have a good day. One last question. Is there an aquarium in the city? Yes, there's a very good one. It's only about six blocks from here. It's in the park next to the train station. Oh, next to the train station. Yes, definitely visit the aquarium. Great. Thanks a lot. You're welcome. Have a good day.
Page 52. Exercise 6. Listening. What are you looking for? Part A. Listen to some hotel guests ask about places to visit in the neighborhood. Complete the chart. Good morning. Can I help you? Yes. We need some directions. Sure. What are you looking for? Well, first of all, we're looking for the Hard Rock Cafe. How far is it from here? Oh, it's just a few minutes from here, right across from the National Bank. The National Bank on Park Avenue? Yes, that's the one. Is the Hard Rock Cafe a nice place? Well, I think so. The food is good, and there are some interesting things to look at in the restaurant, like one of Elvis's cars. Great. And where is the Science Museum? Well, that's near City Hall. Near City Hall, okay. I know where that is. And what's the museum like? Actually, it's not very good. It's small, and there isn't a lot to see there. It's really for young kids. Oh, then maybe we won't go there. Hmm. One last question. Is there an aquarium in the city? Yes, there's a very good one. It's only about six blocks from here. It's in the park, next to the train station. Oh, next to the train station. Yes, definitely visit the aquarium. Great. Thanks a lot. You're welcome. Have a good day. Now, let's answer the questions. Place, location, location like the address. Interesting. The place is interesting or not interesting? Is it a good place to visit or not? 1. Hard Rock Cafe. The Hard Rock Cafe Location across from the National Bank on Park Avenue. The National Bank on Park Avenue. Is it interesting place? Yes. Why? It's a nice place. The food is good. And it's a very nice place. Science Museum. Location. Near City Hall. Near City Hall. Is this an interesting place? No. Not interesting place. Why? Because it's small. It's for kids. For children. Three. Aquarium. Aquarium, it's very big, you see different kinds of fish, different kinds of fish, whale, dolphin, shark, location, in the park, next to the train station, in the park, next to the train station, is the aquarium interesting, yes, is the aquarium far from here? No, it's only six blocks. It's near here. It's only six blocks. It's in the park next to the train station. It's only six blocks near here. B. Which place sounds the most interesting to you? Hard Rock Cafe, Science Museum, or the aquarium? And why? Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like the video and don't forget to subscribe. شكرا للمشاهدة. من فضلك اشترك في القناة لتصلك آخر إصداراتنا.